you know, the epiphany for me comes from connecting with so many people with advanced lung cancer, many in treatment who, like my wife, are already participating in advocacy. Uh, it reminds me of the urgency needed to continue to develop new and better therapeutic options for them. Most don't have the luxury to wait five more years for incremental improvements. Really, their, their lives uh, depend on substantive and sustained efforts to accelerate uh, improvements. Now, there really seem to be limitless opportunities uh, to make an impact as almost any effort to advocate for continued improvements in lung cancer research and science uh, can have an impact. It can be as simple as liking or posting um, or sharing a post about the need for robust lung cancer research funding. Uh, all the way to organized uh, lobbying and, and fundraising efforts. Uh, the important thing is to commit to doing something. Uh, find your comfort zone and use whatever existing skills and fund of knowledge you already have and apply it to your advocacy efforts. And for me, uh, given my background in healthcare, that, that led me to focus my advocacy efforts to, uh, uh, and direct them at clinicians and medical institutions. Lung Cancer Awareness Month can just serve like an, an inspiration. It's just like New Year's, right? It's typically a time to make resolutions. So uh, all the best in your own advocacy efforts.